Hi guys, hi everyone. It's your girl again, Melogis TV, and you all know the only Melo with the gist. Yes, to know them. I'm making this video because I believe my audience need to have some clarity of whatsoever is going on on this platform. I've been dropping some posts today and so many people are still confused what is going on. On TikTok, something happened on TikTok that has been going on for days. There is this lady that went on Prophet Oroch's platform on TikTok. And her case was being followed up. Money was given to her. A lot of things happened. I've been following that program since. I've been following the situation along the line, long time with her. From the day she was forcefully added, I would say she was forcefully added because Lady V is even regretting all what she did. Now, I brought the video here on this page. I did not even edit that video. That video is not even carrying my logo. That video is not having any editing. Even if you look in between the video, you'll see my comment or what I was dropping on Prophet Oroch's page. Prophet Oroch even noticed I'm on that live video later on in the live. On that video, you hear him call me out there. Oh, Melogis, you are here. Now, I brought that video here on Facebook. I dropped it on this page. And people have been engaging. Lots of people who followed the case were engaging on it. This lady that is involved in that case... She came under the post today and started dragging me. She said, tomorrow is pregnant. And see, tomorrow is always pregnant. I am not going to be so hard on you for one reason. And because I respect Prophet Orok a lot. I would have made this video in such a way that would not sit well with so many people. Because at the end of the day, no matter how I would try to analyze that video, Prophet Orok will be involved. And because he was just doing you good, I will not like to drag him into your mess. You came under my video, under my post, and you were commenting and indirectly shading and doing whatever you were doing. You did not end there. You went on your page. You made a video, calling me on the video, tagging me on the video. Do you think if I really want to respond to you, you will stay here? Because I have the weight that we can pull. This bitch, I can sit here and vlog you for straight one more. Nothing will happen. Nobody will stop me. But because for the respect I have for the people on this platform, the audience on this page, who are constantly under the comment section asking me to let go. I'm just here to give clarity. I have not seen where a vlogger or a blogger will carry something that is already on social media. If you don't want your situation to be discussed on media, if you are ashamed that people should not talk about your situation, then you will not go on live video to spill it out there. Because you don't even know who is watching. You don't even know where help will come from. You are dragging me for bringing your situation on my page. Do you know how many people watched that video and were concerned about you? Do you know how many persons would try to reach out? Something is stated on that video and it is everywhere. The truth will remain the truth. No matter how you try to twist it, to do damage control, dragging one blogger to the other for trying to bring what is already on media on their platforms. The truth is there. Everybody that supported you on that platform, either by tagging, by tapping, sending love and like, by sending money, by sending gifts, so many of them are disappointed. And they are not just disappointed, they are angry with what came out at the end of the day. Because you were not ready for any move forward. I will not say too much here, but if you want me to actually analyze that video, because I have the complete live video from the day you were on that show, and the, the live video of yesterday, how many hours that Prophet Aura was live, I have the complete video. I will come here, analyze it, Step by step, even if it's going to take me three months, I will do it. 
to those of you saying that I should uh, not drag Prophet Orok into this, I'm not dragging Prophet Orok into this. The person you should be questioning is Madam Wen. You are going to call my name on your page and you don't want me to respond. Well, for some reasons, I'm not supposed to respond to you. But because people on my platform need clarity, I will do it. So many times I don't respond to dogs bagging. But if I respond to your own dog, it means that the people in my compound need to know why I am responding. Everybody on this platform, they know I don't look for trouble, except trouble come looking for me. If you don't come, I won't come back. Madam, the journey you want to start with me, hope you are ready. Because I'm ready. I am fully ready. Hope you are ready. Guys, that's just all. I don't want to bring analysis here of how the money had to go, who need to travel, what has to go on. Because if I need to start giving details now, so many people will already be angry. Let me just leave it here. But if she has to continue making any other comment or tagging me on any of her posts, I know you are blogging. You need um, exposure. Don't worry. I will give you a better exposure if you want. Because me, I'm ready. Gone are those days that you will just sit and say anything and I will just be calm. This time around, if you mount, I will mount. Whatever you are looking for on media, I'm also looking for that thing. We all are here for the same reason. So anyone that will come in to say, Melo, please don't respond to that woman. She wants your attention. She wants my attention. I'm also seeking attention here on this space. So we can do it and do it very well. I know so many people will be disappointed, but I need I needed to do this clarity. It is video that I brought here. Without me saying anything, I use one word in the comment section. I said, the woman, Alinos. If you follow that video, you see how she was struggling to put her words together. You see how long Prophet Orok sat on his platform waiting for this woman to join until when she arrived the so-called hospital. Let me just end it here. I'm waiting for another post. I am waiting for another post. For the respect I have for my audience and for Prophet Orok, I will not say more. I will just leave it here and I will not continue. Hope you guys understand me very well why I've been making the posts I've been making this morning. Hope you guys understand me. If you want to respond to me with video, I will also respond to you with videos. So if you are ready, I am ready. You don't know. On this page, I talk for a living. 